Hey guys, it's Shane McElrath. We are here in Melbourne, Australia. Today's the first beautiful day that we've had. No, cl no clouds in the sky. Uh, I'm excited to announce that I've signed with Honda Racing Australia. I'll be racing the Australian Supercross Series as well as the World Supercross Series with uh, Yuriv and the guys. So um, I'm super excited to uh, get this thing underway. It's uh, time to go. It's rough in places, like the the bumps are like edges. They're not breaking bumps. It's like the dirt's falling away. And that's the only place where it's rigid, but that's kind of normal Supercross stuff. And it, but the over there, like that straight, it starts like halfway down the straight. Yeah. It's like acceleration bumps and uh, the breaking bumps are, are the same. Yeah. Like, when I stood over there, you did your run yeah. before that, so it's like acceleration yeah. bump straight into the brake bump. Yeah, right. you're just kind of skipping around all the way down there straight away. But yeah, this, I like this stuff. I like that sag. So. But yeah, we get to ride again today. It's Tuesday and we fly out on Thursday. I think the truck leaves tomorrow morning. So um, yeah, we're I'm riding a couple different forks today just to get a little bit better feeling. Um, this track here is a little bit tight, but the rhythms and the the jumps are pretty, pretty good. So yeah, we're just uh, putting some time in and that's, it rained quite a bit yesterday and the track is, I don't, I don't think it's a little wet. It's uh, it's got good moisture in it, but Cole and Joey rode yesterday, and it, it was it was a little sloppy. But yeah, I think uh, I think it's gonna be good. We got a lot of guys out here, and I'm excited to ride the bike again. I love that bike. It's hard to say it's the best bike I've ever ridden, but that bike is really good. I, I'm telling you. And this is just the 25. I do have uh, two days on the 24. I rode that in uh, uh, Tallahassee uh, earlier this week, and it was it was okay. Like just kind of getting the feel of it. Um, the Honda was definitely different, but getting here and getting on this bike. It's kind of kind of a different engine setup, different gearing setup, but I'm telling you, this bike right here is that was fun. That was really fun. We're, this track today is is honestly pretty good. Um, we're we're softening the suspension a little bit um, and speeding it up. It's uh yeah not not moving that much, but I'm dude the balance about dude that was fun.
How'd that look? I don't know what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> he just uh, makes it look easy. I get out there and I'm nearly flipping it. <laughs> yeah, so that, it, it's all about locking, locking on your legs and making sure your, your hips are rotated out because then when you activate your core, you automatically lean forward, but your butt doesn't slide back. Yeah. And that's how, like up here, I have full like mobility of my hands to use the controls to compensate for a wheelie if that happens, but I didn't need to because it just whirr, like there's no braking power. Just get the feel of this sprocket and stuff and try and figure out the RPMs. Yeah. The technique stuff will take a little bit of time, but don't stress about that. Just try to figure out where can I consistently start, start RPM wise yeah. to where I know how I can compensate for the bike to start working with it. Because obviously we race this weekend, so it's, it's there's not a lot that can change from like a fundamental standpoint before then, but yeah. to try to build the consistency. I think it definitely takes off a little fast for him once he gets out there. Yeah. That's where you can't let up. It's like once you drive that well, you have to stay in it. You have to keep committed and keep yeah. powering through, otherwise it comes yeah. up too much. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like yeah. it started to come up because you just loosened up yeah, and yeah. set up. But it's like once the way you drive off the grate, that's how you drive, stay in that position until after you shift through third gear, and that way it doesn't matter if you wheelie. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Yep. But when you stay in it, it's like that's that's better than 75% of the other guys that's going to be out there. Yeah. And so now you're at least top five. Yeah. yeah. How are you feeling now? Yeah. Better. More confident yeah, in myself. I was so hopeless yeah. before. Now he gave me yeah, some yeah, wisdom. You, you don't, you don't need you know, it's yeah. perfect. <laughs> So we finished up riding this week. We got to, to come here to Australia, get on the 2025 Honda 250, and dude, I am blown away from the very beginning. Um, hope you enjoy some of the riding clips, but uh, tomorrow we set sail for Brisbane. It's about a two hour plane flight, and uh, yeah, it's round one and two of the Australian series, and uh, yeah, I'm excited to show you guys what I got on the 250 again. This new Honda is, uh, man, I. I can't say enough good things about it. I couldn't believe when I got on the bike, the balance, the feel, the suspension, um, and the power uh, for it to be a 250. It's, uh, it's impressive, so um, stay tuned. <laughs>